Questions for Junior? What have you seen throughout the game that led you to the performance you had? You know, just uh, you know, just the basics. Uh, Coach Joe just preaches a lot on you know just fine wine, you know, just finding the details, the small details, you know, just such as just you know tip of the pad or ending at the quarterback's feet, you know. And as a as a D line, I think we did a good job at ending at the quarterback's feet all night, especially in the second half. Junior, um, so what is Coach Joe? Does he give you like carte blanche to be out there because it's in a three man front, four man Roman and? And then the fourth quarter, you're like lights out all the time. So, what, what kind of marching orders does he give you? You know, it's crazy. Uh, he gives us the, the most simple marching orders. You know, he tries to simplify the game as, as much as possible for the D line. You know, doesn't want to have us thinking too much. You know, just playing fast and, like I said, getting to the quarterback's feet every play. Uh, Junior, you had three sacks tonight. Two of those came late in the second half. How great does it feel knowing those two sacks had a huge impact in the game? You know, it's just, uh, you know, I'm playing for my brother, you know, every play. So just to be able to, you know, to show up when, you know, they need they need someone to make a play, you know, and, and I just happen to be the one to make that play, you know, it just means a lot to them. And it means a lot to me just showing up for them. Junior, can you comment on uh, conditioning and whatnot? Because, like, you're, again, you're, all four quarters you're playing hard and coaching P. I'm just kind of curious what that, that does. Yes, sir. It's just a... Uh, during the week, you know, just getting the extra in the weight room, such as, you know, just little bike sprints, you know, intervals and just just the little things, you know. I'm not I'm not able to take as many reps during the week, so I gotta find different places and different areas to get my conditioning in. How would you describe the emotions you guys had uh, in the days leading up to Wednesday? Uh just I I'll describe it with just the word love, you know. Just everybody's just loving each other up all week, you know. Started an all time high this week and you know it showed tonight. They never play all four quarters. You and Cade combined for uh, seven sacks. It's just once again incredible seeing how you guys came in here together. What was it like doing that with them tonight? Man, it's like a dream come true. You know, we always joke about it every series. Hey, man, I'm going to race you to the quarterback, you know, and that's all we were doing all night, four quarters, just racing to the quarterback. Yeah, so Junior, um, in the last minute drive where Nevada was um, trying to tie the game, there was one play where um, the Nevada quarterback had been wrapped up, but then was able to scramble for 12 yards and then able to tie the play. What did you see unfold during that play? Uh, you know, just you just got to keep playing. You know, uh, no matter good or bad, what happens on the play, we just got to keep playing. Rally, you know, get population to the ball. So at the end of the day, we just got to react and keep playing. Um, how emotional was that uh, lean on me uh, song Man. at the end with all, with all your teammates? You know, it just means a lot to us. Uh, brotherhood is it's all Coach Brendan preaches, you know, brotherhood and family and culture. And just, you know, just being able to, you know, put that on display for the whole San Jose to see, you know, just, just gives, them, gives them a glimpse of our, our little family that we have here in Seth. Any more questions for Junior? All right. Thank you. Thank you.